Welcome back. Here's something you might not know. There's a flower named not only for its bright color, but its relationship with the biggest star in our sky, the sunflower. Meteorologist Courtney Jacobazzi joins us from our backyard garden with some tips for yours. Welcome back to the 13 WMAZ Backyard Garden. This week we're talking all about my personal favorite flower, the sunflower. They are in full bloom right now, and as many of you probably know, sunflowers follow the sun. But do you know why? During the day, the sun's heat provides food for plants, but at night, moonlight takes over. Think of sunflowers as the most frugal flower. They use every ounce of radiation to grow. As the sun rises in the east, the right side of the stem gets a boost in growth. That causes the stem to tilt west along with the sun as it travels through the sky. At night, the radiation from the moonlight does the same thing to the left side of the stem, so the bud leans right again to wait for the sun to rise. When it comes to growing these beautiful bright flowers, Georgia is great for it. Our long, sunny spring and summer days are just what these sun soaking plants need. Our soils, while sometimes a bit acidic, are fine for sunflowers, but they do need a well drained soil and a nutrient dense one. Supplementing a compost or fertilizer helps. Be sure to give them plenty of room to stretch. Six inches apart are what you need to plant the seeds at in each row. Make those about 30 inches apart. Now we would love to see your sunflower photos or anything growing in your backyard garden. Text those photos to the number on your screen, 478-752-1309. Again, that's 478-752-1309. From the 13 WMAZ Backyard Garden to yours, I'm meteorologist Courtney Jacobazzi. Thank you, Courtney. That is very cool. Next time we'll be showing off some of your backyard garden. So don't forget to text in those photos to the number Courtney just mentioned. We cannot wait to see them. Uh, Alex, as for me, I will be staying away from the sun because it's just <laughs> too hot out there.